Tell me where you are, tell me where you are Summer nights, bright lights and the shooting stars Still break my heart Calling you now but you're not picking up Shadows so close and that's still in the air Light a match, light a match, baby in the dark Show me where you are Oh love, how I miss you every single day When I see you on those streets today's vlog I am about to head off to work I've had a very interesting morning um, yesterday was the day that I lost my keys and had that whole situation happen um, I don't know if I told you guys I know I talked about it on my Instagram my dad dropped off my spare set of keys and the battery's dead on those which I we figured out a way where I can still start my car um, and this morning was the first time I tried driving it with those set of keys because it's a keyless fob So there's no actual like I don't put a key in the ignition And because the battery's dead it key it, the car doesn't sense it. So this morning after the gym I had to go to the grocery store and Basically when I <laughs> went to get back in my car it, it started going off thinking I was like breaking into the car so that was pretty awesome and embarrassing <laughs> and I'm like I promise like I'm not breaking into my car like these are my keys, like I have everything, it's just the battery's dead. Um, so I didn't have a fabulous start to my morning. My workout was really good. I did another Cardio Boss workout, which you guys um, just saw. And then I did go back to the gym yesterday with Chris, and I'm about to show you the couple clips I have from that. Um, 
I really only went back just because he um, wanted to work out. I had already done my cardio and I wasn't planning on lifting, but I ended up doing like a little bit of arms and did like, I think one or two shoulder exercises. I don't know, it was basically just messing around a little bit. So I'm gonna head off to work. Um, hopefully my mood changes a little bit. I'm just like frustrated with the whole key situation. <sighs> but deep breaths, you can't control everything around you. Stuff is always gonna go wrong. Um, and if you focus on all the negatives rather than the positives, you're just going to always be in a negative attitude because you can always find something wrong in a day. And we're not going to do that today. We're going to focus on the positives. We're going to get to work, work really hard, get everything done. We need to get done. And then we are, tomorrow's Friday, so it's almost the weekend. I just keep telling myself that. I'm like, this weekend we're just going to relax. <laughs> like, I just need to relax and unwind. <sighs> I told you guys I was gonna do good at work. Like, that is one thing I don't know about you guys. If my day starts off not too hot, I like pick something that I'm just gonna give my all that I can be proud of at the end of the day. So it, it's, I don't know, a little bit like, not rewarding yourself, but just giving yourself something to be proud of. Like, yes, I did a good job in my workout, but like this morning is just like I have negative energy attached to it. So today I am just focusing hard, doing a good job, doing a good job at work, feeling productive here because then at least the rest of my day was a success and I can be happy with myself and what I did and accomplished. But my feet are wet. I didn't realize we had that much snow back there. All right. I'm going to finish answering emails and then I need to count the hats so they're ready for Monday's lunch. All right, the lighting is horrible, but I am just chilling um, outside of our place, listening to some music. I stopped at Starbucks and got a venti, venti, not trenta, um, jade citrus mint tea, no sweetener because we're not trying to be bloated again like I made myself before. And I got a water because I finished my gallon. So I'm, and I had other water earlier today during my workout. So I've had probably like one and a third, one and a fourth gallons today so far. Um, but Christopher has our apartment keys or his apartment keys because I don't have mine obviously. <laughs> Cause I lost mine. So we need to make a copy of those tonight so I don't have to do this but I'm just hanging out until he gets home. And yeah, it's very, very exciting. The battery that my dad gave me um, is dead as well, it seems. And so when I get into my car, like there's a way to start it. It's just kind of like janky. And in order for me to get in my car and like start it, my, my car legitimately thinks that someone's breaking into it. Like it, starts beeping so it's very embarrassing <laughs> like honking like very loud honking and when I finally get my car to turn on it's like theft attempt like no it's just me trying to get in my own car <sighs> uh, so yes anyway enough complaining today ended up being pretty good I was very productive this morning um I got a lot done right in the morning but I'm gonna sit wait for Chris drink this and then I honestly, oh, look at that. I'm spilling all over myself. 
oh like all over myself wow good job kelly all right clearly i just shouldn't be allowed to do anything <laughs> uh, like i was saying i'm gonna go in and probably take a nap and just relax tonight because 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 of all of this that i'm just telling you the past two days have just not been my days but that's all right you gotta have bad ones to have the really good ones and appreciate the really good ones so Alrighty friends, I am cooking up my bison for my last meal of the day. I can choose between chicken, turkey, and bison every once in a while. The bison tastes very, very good, and because I have chicken already today, it's in my meal plan. I like switching it up if I can, so I'm making this, and then I'm going to have my cauliflower with it, which I don't think I have enough, so I'll probably have to put some broccoli with it as well. But I finally made a decision on a skincare routine to try. Obviously, I don't know how I'm gonna look, like if I'm gonna like it at all. Um, but this is a kit for 85 bucks, where you get three full-size products. I just did two fingers for three items. I just got out of the bath, so my face is so red. Um, but yeah, so I, I thought it was a really, really good deal. It is Tula, which you guys have recommended to me. So, let's see if I can... yeah, so it's three-step balanced skin bundle. I looked up a lot of the products that people recommended to me and they all had really, really good reviews, but some of them were very expensive and like, I really don't need much. The cleanser, this comes with, um, okay, so you get the purifying cleanser, which, which is 6.7 fluid ounces, so that's pretty big. The Pro Glycolic pH resurfacing gel and hydrating day and night cream. So that sounds very simple. It sounds like stuff that I would like. Um, I took their little skincare test and that's the products that it said I would benefit most from with what my goals are and how my skin is. So I'm excited to try them. Like I said, 85 bucks to me, I don't think is bad in terms of three full size products for skincare. Um, a few of the products I looked up were like literally $85 for one. So I'm gonna try this. Obviously I'll let you guys know what I think of it once I get it and try it for a couple weeks. Um, but yeah, I'm excited. I finally pulled the trigger on that because I don't have bad skin by any means, but it could be a little bit better. My shoulder hurts so bad. All right, I'm going to finish making my meal, and I will catch up with you guys in a little bit. What are you doing, weirdo? Bill? Bill? What are you doing? She's being so weird. I just finished editing the video and I'm going to conclude it here, but I did want to mention, I like, I love the Winter Olympics and I was trying to watch the figure skating that was on tonight and what else? I think freestyle skiing or something like that. And we don't have, we just have YouTube TV, like, because neither Chris and I don't really watch that much TV. And the Olympics is being shown on NBC and there is like, I cannot find a way to live stream it. Like NBC won't let me do their live stream. So if you guys know any ways that I can watch the Olympics, please comment down below and let me know because I'm gonna be so sad if I can't watch it or if I like can't watch it at home. Like I'm, I'm sure we could go over to Chris's parents, but I'm all bummed out. So please let me know if you know a way that I can watch it. Um, and yeah, I'm going to wrap the video up here so it's not too long. And I will see you guys bright and early tomorrow morning for probably another leg workout. I might even do, yeah, no, legs. We'll do legs.